Hey guys, welcome back to another video of the channel. Yes, we are just came back from the Southampton stream. Oh, fuck me. Uh, where do I begin? Absolute disaster class. Everywhere in that Newcastle pitch today. Every single one of those players, the manager, the coaches. Everyone involved in that club today should be ashamed. What a shit performance that was. But uh, first off, thank you everyone who's came up my live stream, by the way. Great once again, so thank you all for your support. Especially people who donate as well, actually legends. But Southampton, first off, get this out of the way straight away. It's not beat around the bush. Better team by now. Deserve the win. Congrats. Top of, the, top of the Premier League for the first time in their Premier League history, so congrats, you know, enjoy it while you can, because let's face it, it's going to be very tough to stay up there, but, yeah, anyway, if you're new to the channel, make sure you get down there, subscribe, I'll really enjoy, and, uh, yeah, let's pretty much get, get out of the way, get out of the way now, Newcastle, absolute fucking disgrace, let's, let's, let's begin, let's not even, just, let's just get on with it, um, biggest problem today, um, these players, um, people can blame the manager, for me, you put the right line-up, you put the exact same line-up, beat Everton, Quite comfortably beat Everton as well last week. I know they're missing key players, but Southampton today were missing key players. Danny Ings, you know, without a doubt, their best player. And um, sadly, he's injured. You know, I dumped Danny Ings. He's always an injury prone player, so I hope you recover. But missing him, missing Ryan Burchant, right? I said before they get my mates, I said I thought Chadens would struggle without him. How wrong was I? Che Adams bossed off the park. Um, absolute disgrace. Uh, I mean, where do we even begin? I'm just, I'm just so fucking pissed off, guys. I mean, Everything was wrong today. Everything was wrong from the selection, from the team lineup, from the rotation of players. I mean, it was all wrong. I'm seeing a lot of people saying Steve Bruce out right. Right now, with Mike Ashley as the owner of our club, who can we get that's a better manager? We cannot get any, anyone in. Eddie Harry is not that much of a better manager of Bruce to allow him to go and then bring someone else in. They were caused so much disruption along the team. He's not that good. Um, he would not be much of an upgrade. He cannot work with turds. Um, I, I, Steve Bruce is not a good manager, right? He doesn't play good football, he doesn't play good tactics, he doesn't play good rotation. But that team is crap. Jeff Henwick is disgustingly bad. He is absolute crap. It's like watching a team of Stevie Wonders. I mean, it's, it's, it's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. I mean, honestly, fucking get get the cast of Bob the Builder. They'll do a better job than that team. It was absolutely disgusting. Uh, honestly, it was, I'm so annoyed. How, how are we so bad? I mean... I probably think that's our worst performance of the season, but then again, we were shit against Brighton, we were shit against Wolves, we were shit against Tottenham, but half the time we get results, that's the only, that's the only difference, uh, but, I mean, it's just a joke, uh, first goal, I mean, Almeron, he runs with the ball in the edge of the box, he then loses it, and then he, he just gives the goal away, there you are, Chelems, there you are, and then the Sells leaves him in the middle, I mean, who's Martin Chelems, he's got all the space in the middle, the volley and the goal, I mean, Dolo was the only good player on that team today, and even then, he had sloppy moments in that game, but he was saving the shots, and he was keeping us in that game, it was just unbelievable. I mean, our best chance of the old game came from a player that came off the bench, Joe Linton, with an unbelievable header, by the way. How did he not score? I want to save that was by McCarthy, but a 20 yard header was our best chance all game. It's disgusting. It's absolutely disgusting. Every single one of those players, right, in Southampton right now, complaining that they can't come back to Newcastle because of flights are off at 10 o'clock. Get fucked. You put in that performance and you're complaining that you can't get back to Newcastle tonight. Every single one of you, you should literally be on the streets tonight after that performance. Absolutely disgusting. Uh, I mean, I can't believe it. Jacob Murphy was shit. Hendrick was shit. Uh, who else was terrible? Jamal Lewis is pretty crap, let's be honest. Uh, Sim Maxman, I thought, had a stink out there. He was really bad. I mean, everyone, apart from Dollar, was bad today. Um, literally, I didn't think anyone added anything. I thought Joe Linton Cowell actually, you know, looked like they were going to do something when they came on. But, I mean, I'm just, I'm so fucking pissed off. I um, we may ask you at the club, we will continue to be inconsistent. This is what happens with these sort of players. If you get these sort of players, it's because they're inconsistent. I mean, you have to buy good good level of money to get these top players nowadays. That team right now, they would not win every single match. If we won every single match, we'll be in the Champions League, which is obviously we're not ever going to do. So we're going to drop points of time, but still, it's not good enough. I expect I don't mind losing games, but I expect us to try. Manu, right, I defend that Manu performance that every single fan bollocked it. Because we, I thought we tried Naki, I thought we were unlucky, we got picked off at the end, I thought we had a chance, but today was absolutely disgraceful, every single one of those players should get fucked for all I care, I'm, I'm pissed off, I'm, I'm not happy at all. I sat there for three hours right there, freeze my arse off with bastard fireworks going off outside, I can't be bothered, but uh, yeah, I'm just I'm just so annoyed, I mean, oh Christ, Christ, Christ. I mean, currently in lockdown, can't go to the pubs, and that's the performance to put in. Get fucked. But uh, thank you guys for watching. I'm um, disgusted by any cast over there. I mean, shocking. But take care. Uh, don't know what my next video is going to be, but it'll be at some point. Uh, but thank you all for watching. Uh, we're now at 6,500 subscribers, by the way. So if you haven't subscribed, why well, do make sure I do that? But thank you all for watching. Take care. I'll see you on the next one.